Hello everyone, in today's tutorial we shall be learning how to perfectly insert Word document table into PowerPoint slides. So we shall be using this table as an example. We shall insert the table, edit the table in PowerPoint to suit our desire. To insert this table we first copy this table and to do this we highlight the table so to highlight the table there are many ways we can do this we can put our cursor to the upper left hand side of the table then hold down and highlight to the lower right hand of the table we can as well hold the cursor at the lower right of the table, then we highlight to the upper left hand side of the table. Then we can click this plus sign. When we click on it, it will highlight the table. Having highlighted the table, we use Ctrl plus C to copy the table or we use this copy here at the home tab to copy the table. We go to PowerPoint. At the upper left hand side of PowerPoint, we click and we use Ctrl plus V to paste the table. From the home tab, you can increase the size of the table by left clicking, holding and dragging the table from any of the four edges to increase it. To increase it, we left click, we hold the table and increase the table. You can increase the height by putting your cursor here, as it turns to two headed arrows, you drag it up to increase the height. From here, you can make it wider. You can as well move the table around the slide when you put your cursor here to turn to this four headed arrow. You left click, you can move the table around. You can make changes to the body of this table to suit your desires. You can remove serial number from here and just put number. Let's say we want to change the color on the serial number. All we have to do is to first highlight the column. Then from this table design, we click on it. Shading. We click on the drop down arrow. We can then choose any color we want. Or maybe we did not see the color we want here. We can click on more few colors to see more colors. Then we can hover over these colors to make our choice. We can increase the transparency or reduce it from here. We can use custom color to select the desired colors. Then when we are satisfied, we click on OK. To add new row to this table, we go to the last cell in the table and put our cursor there. Then we press the tab key. We can change the sizes of the content or of the letters in this table. When we highlight the table, let's say we want to increase the content of the heading of this table. We highlight the heading. We can change the font. We can increase this or reduce the size from the font size. To delete any row or column, you highlight. You use the backspace to delete it. You can right click to merge cells, to split the cells, and to do so many other things within the cells as you have pasted it in the PowerPoint. We can change the design of the table. When we hover over these designs, we can select the design we want. If we are not satisfied with these ones, we click on this drop down to have more designs to choose from. So this is how you add table to your PowerPoint when it becomes necessary that you should add tables from Word document to your PowerPoint. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please like the video, subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon so YouTube will notify you once I drop a new video. And don't forget to share this video with family and friends. Have a great day.